The asteroid that died the dinosaurs wasn't alone. 66 million years ago, a huge asteroid hit Earth. Ending the reign of dinosaurs. Two years ago, after the discovery of a large crater shocking off the coast of Guinea has been suggested that this cosmic rock she had a relative. In new research, researchers confirmed that 66 million years this Earth was hit by not one but two large asteroids. In 2022, scientists discovered a huge one on the coast of Guinea it's a strike crater. The data collected at the time suggested that it had about 66 million years, the same as Shiksalab or crater in the Gulf of Mexico which was created under the impact of the asteroid responsible for the destruction of dinosaurs. Scientists or not they examined the crater directly at the time, but suspected that he might have something to do with this asteroid. New, detailed studies of the crater confirm that it was created he is the result of the impact of a large cosmic rock at the end of the chalk, about 66 a million years ago. Results and description of the study published in Communications Earth and the Environment. Crater called Nader was discovered while floor mapping C in 2022. It's not as big as Sheikhsalub who counts 150 km in diameter. Nader is about 9 km in diameter. There is over 300 m under the seabed about 400 kilometers from the coast of Guinea in West Africa. Data collected during the bottom mapping went to Uis Dean Nicholson of Harriet Watt University in Edinburgh. It is him, in cooperation with scientists from the United Kingdom and the United States were the first to characterize the crater. The data collected at the time suggested that it came from the impact of an asteroid o the width of hundreds of meters about 66 million years ago, but then the researchers could not this is clearly stated. Now they can. To confirm their suspicions, the researchers used the data high resolution CCCC collected by TGS. The data proves that the crater Nader was formed by the impact of the asteroid. There are about 20 confirmed sea craters in the world, but none of them was captured in such a detailed way. This is extraordinary. This data allows us to fully image the structure in three dimensions and removal of the layer of sedimentary rocks to look at the crater itself on all levels, Nicholson said. TGS compares crater imaging to progress impression of ultrasound of pregnant women. A few generations ago, the ultrasound showed it's a grainy stain. Now you can see the characteristics of the child in 3D and it is in amazing details, including all internal organs. The same is in ours, research. We went from two-dimensional, blurry imaging to the amazing imaging of the Nader crater in high resolution he noted. Most craters are born, but this one is good he kept, which means that scientists could see him in the smallest details. This is the first time we've seen it inside the impact crater, such as this one. It's really exciting he emphasized Nicholson. We see impecky shock craters on bodies airless like the moon, but we have no information about the subsurface structure there. On Earth, it is the opposite. We have data about structure from seismic research, field mapping and drill cores, but craters are usually very degenerated. New 3D seismic images the crater Nader gives us both. It's a surprisingly good view of the crater Veronica Bray of the University of Arizona, said Veronica Bray. Initially, the researchers decided that the cosmic rock that it produced the crater Nader was about 400 meters wide. New, detailed, detailed the imaging showed that it was about 50 to 100 meters larger. The calculations they suggested hit the Earth at about 20 kilometers per second, or 72,000 km per hour, although this still needs confirmation. 
Scientists cannot accurately determine the date of the event or it occurred before or after the impact of the asteroid that left behind the 180km crater Sheikhsalab. But they indicate that a smaller asteroid hit in the Earth also at the end of the Cretaceous, i.e. at a similar time. New 3D seismic data from the entire Nader crater is an unprecedented opportunity to test hypotheses about craters' impact strikes, development of new models of crater formation in the environment land understanding the consequences of such an event, Nicholson said. Using this data Nicholson with his own associates created the axis of time of what happened after the impact. Shortly after it was an extremely loud thunder and urge the air, and then seismic shock of magnitude 7 earthquake magnitude grass degree. Huge amounts of water probably left the seabed and later they went back cascadingly. A tsunami of at least 800 high meters that moved across the Atlantic. The damaged zone covered thousands of square kilometers outside its a crater. The researchers also claim that the asteroid after the impact produced fireballs. Imagine an asteroid is hitting Glasgow and we're in Edinburgh, about 50 miles away. A sphere of fire would be about 24 times the sun in the sky big enough to set fire to trees and plants in Edinburgh, he says Nicholson. We have submitted a proposal to IODP-3, a new international drilling program for drilling in the seabed and obtaining cores from the crater. This will give us more information about the pressures that occur during strokes and exact age and order of events that occurred after that, the incident, Nicholson said. In the cores, scientists can find minerals, which were created in extreme conditions under enormous pressure and in presence of high temperatures. Scientists suggest that the asteroid that created the crater Nader, it was roughly the size of the asteroid venue. This object circles the sun as 14 months. According to experts, there is a probability, 1 to 2700, that a rock this will hit the Earth at the end of the 21st century, on September 24, 2182. 24888888888888888888888888888888888888888888888888888888888888888888888888888888888888888888888888888888888888888888888888888888888888888888888888888888888888888888888888888888888888888888888888888888888888888888888888888888888888888888888888888888888888888888888888888888888888888888888